Assalamualaikum and good day everyone. How are you today? I hope everybody is doing well and please stay safe at home. Are you ready for today's lesson? Let's start. Year 6. Unit 8. How the tiger got its stripes. Reading comprehension. Lesson 2. For today's lesson, there are four activities that we are going to do. Firstly, for introduction, we are going to get to know the characters as well as the setting. Then, we are going to listen and read the story title, How the Tiger Got Its Stripes. After that, we are going to sequence the story accordingly. And finally, a task for you to do. You are going to answer the questions based on the story by clicking the link provided. Are you ready? Let's start! Activity 1. Introduction. Characters and setting. These are the main characters in the story that we are going to read. Tiger, Buffalo and Man. Setting, place and time. The story took place in a paddy field and as for time, it was a bright and sunny morning. Okay, now let's move on to the next activity. Activity 2. Listen and read. How the tiger got its stripes. Okay everyone, please read along while listening. They once lived a very proud tiger. One day, the tiger saw a mighty buffalo pulling a plow through a paddy field. The tiger appeared in front of the buffalo. Buffalo, why do you let yourself be tied to a plow and work so hard? You are so huge and strong. It is because man rules over me and the other animals on his farm. He says it is his wisdom that allows him to control us. He is a very smart being. If only I had his wisdom, I would be able to control all the animals. I would make them stand still while I choose my meal of the day. The next day, the tiger appeared in front of the man. What do you want, tiger? I want your wisdom. Give me your wisdom. Wisdom? Wisdom is not something I can give you. Yes, you can. Give it to me or I will kill you. The man thought for a while and said, Okay, I give you my wisdom, but I left it in my house. Wait here, I'll go and get it. Let me put a rope around you and tie you to a tree so that you cannot kill my goats. The man said slyly. The tiger agreed. The man wound the rope around its face, body and legs. Then he tied the tiger to a tree and ran home with his goats. The tiger waited for the man, but he never returned. The tiger said to itself, I'm hungry. I'm going to eat one of the man's goats. The tiger pulled and pulled at the rope with all its might. Finally, it broke free. The tiger did not realize the rope had burned stripes onto its shiny coat. The tiger roared in anger. Where are the goats? Where is the man's? Where is my wisdom? Roar. The man has cheated me. Angry, exhausted and thirsty, the tiger went to a lake for a drink. When the tiger saw itself in the water, it screamed. 
What happened to my beautiful shiny coat? Why is it covered with stripes? All the animals saw its stripes and started laughing. The buffalo stopped pulling the plow and said, Hey tiger, what happened to you? You look ugly. The tiger was very embarrassed of its stripes. The tiger ran away and hid itself deep in the jungle. The end. Alright everyone, I do hope you enjoyed the story and also finally knew how the tiger got its stripes. Let's move on to the next activity. Activity 3. Sequence the story accordingly. Sequence the sentences in the correct order. Okay, now I'll give you a minute to read through and try out on your own first. Then we are going to check the answers together. Your one minute starts now. Okay everyone, time's up. Have you got the answers? Let's check them together. So the first one is already done for you. One day, the tiger saw a buffalo working for a man. So which sentence is number two? Yes, that's right. The answer is, it wanted the man's wisdom. Next one, number three. The man was afraid the tiger would eat his goods. How about number four? Which sentence? That's right. So, he tied the tiger to a tree. Number five? Yes, the man went home with his animals. Number six? That's right. The tiger broke free from the tree. And number seven, it saw its reflections. Next one, number eight. The buffalo and the other animals laughed. And finally, number nine. Finally, the tiger hid in the jungle. Well done, everyone. I hope you got all the answers right. We have come to the end of the lesson. Activity 4. Task to do. I want you to click the link provided and answer the comprehension question given. Well, that's all for today's lesson. See you next time. Bye!